Yeah, you know, that was one of the things that we talked about that we stressed, and then our guys did a good job of committing themselves to boxing out, to rebounding, to pursuing the ball. Um, they are an outstanding team at both ends of the court, and then they go get it and get themselves second possessions and limit you to one. And so, you know, that was actually that was a key part of what we were trying to control today. Why were you able to shoot 52% from the field? <laughs> Who asked that question? Mm -hmm. Who's me? Okay. Um, you know, I spent the last couple of days figuring out why we only shot 33% against Villanova. Um, you know, the ball went in today. The ball went in today. Um, I, our guys did a good job of sharing the ball and hitting the open man and being ready to shoot. Um, that was a part of it. Uh, you know, they, they closed space so fast. Um, and when you're open, you're only open for a split second. I thought our guys did a good job with their shot prep of being ready to shoot when you're open. And then we made the extra pass and got open shots. Trey Campbell, 21 points tonight. Um, you know, he obviously well above his average career high. What was he doing tonight to be able to, to knock so many shots down? Well, he just came out aggressive. The ball went in and he stayed with it. You know, I don't think, I think, it, it, Sitting here, having, not having reviewed, every one of those shots was a good shot. You know, it wasn't like he was forcing anything. Everything was a good shot, and the ball. He was in his rhythm, and his teammates kept trying to find him. So, that that's, that that also lends to the previous question of of our guys knew he was hot. We were trying to get him shots. Had opportunities. Sorry, you've had opportunities to get that quote signature win this season. A few that you just fell short tonight to finally. Um, get over the hump and make the plays you needed to make late in a game against a good opponent and get that win on the road. Um, what, what does that do for your team moving forward? Um, what are your it feels really good right now. Um, you know, we've been close so many times this year. Uh, and the guys keep fighting, keep scrapping. And, you know, I think, <clears throat> and not just at the end of the game, I think at, and I'm not sure what time period exactly, but I'm going to say, you know, the, the, 13 minute mark through the six or seven minute mark is where in the past we've been making mistakes and we didn't make as many during that period uh, today. And so, you know, our schedule is really tough. Our pre 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 league schedule was tough. This league is the best league in the country. Every night is tough. Um, and so, you know, I told these guys before the game, you know, we've we've been close, but here's another opportunity, and we're going to have another opportunity, another opportunity. And that's 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 uh, the good and sometimes the bad of playing in the Big East, uh, where is the level of competition is really high. But to come in here and get this win here um, against this team, uh, which which they're they're playing at such a high level right now, uh, it feels good. And and. I'm going to go along with how you phrased the question. We're now over the hump <laughs> and going to, going to <coughs> proceed from here. Questions for Drew? Devontae, to try? Devontae, uh, you've always been a passionate player, but coming to this building with your history as Avery, does, is there a little something extra here? Uh, it, def it definitely is. Um, I talked to you know Coach Mack and Coach Still before the game, so um, you know, I love those guys. Uh, you know, still have a close relationship with them, but uh, I'm glad to come here and get a win. It's the first time that we won here, so and it's my last time playing here. So, enjoy going back and forth with the fans. I think that's been an ongoing thing for the last. Yeah, few years. it's always fun. Always fun. <laughs> Any? Trey, can you talk about? much that confidence as you kept making shots kind of built as you as the game went on? I mean when I first made my first shot I knew I was gonna be good. Like my teammates kept finding me like they said. I just felt I just felt fine and I had a rhythm. Do you think that you got more opportunities against their zone or did that have any impact in it? No, nah, it was both man and zone I was knocking down shots. Transition yeah transition. Oh, It's conference play, and in this league, you know whether you're ranked or not ranked, whether you're 
currently the number one team or the number ten team. We're in league play now. None of that, none of that matters. All, all that goes out the window. Um, you know, in, in our league, whoever is number one can lose to whoever is number ten, and everyone in between. So all that stuff is irrelevant. It's conference play right now, and, and everybody, every opponent, um, every team has to come prepared, or you can lose. Any other questions? You uh, talk, talk about the, the fact that you guys did make that extra pass, especially in brunch time. It seemed like uh, the ball was really getting around the different guys. Talk about that. Uh, we knew, you know, we knew if they were going to change defenses a lot, so. Uh, had to, you know, make basketball plays. Uh, a lot of the times, you know, it was Trey early on that was, you know, open and he made the shots that, you know, we needed to stay in the game at that point. And, you know, they were making a lot of big shots also. So, uh, you know, we just wanted to come out and continue to defend and, you know, continue to move the ball. We knew we'd get open looks and we just had to knock them down. How big was this win? Um, obviously, you're only halfway through the season and not even halfway through the conference play. But how, how big can this win turn out to be for you? Uh, it's, it's really big. I mean, it's every win, you know, hopefully from here on out is, is going to be big. Uh, you know, and like you said, every game is going to be tough. And, you know, if you can come out with a win, especially on the road, uh, it's good.